morning, everybody. Um, I'm making Anna a bottle. Ooh, watch out. Get out of the kitchen, please. Mom. It's hot. Yes. Oh, wow. The is gone. Oh, no. What's gone? This one. Oh, no. Go find some more. Come here, Mama. Come here. Okay. I'm trying to make baby her bottle. She's hungry. Oh, okay. Find some more. He needs to clean up his room today. This is what he needs to do. Let's find G. Look for it. Is that it? There it is! And I just finished this today. It's a fabric tutu. I will have a tutorial on this coming up on Tuesday. Oh, my baby. Okay. Mom. Yes. Go put them. We gotta clean this house. Like, really clean this house. And not the yet. Okay, go put it over there because I need to make baby her bottle. She's getting kind of fussy. Okay? I'll play with you as soon as she's done. Or as soon as I'm done making it for her. There you go. Now go here. Oh, uh, turn around. Oh. Oh no, turn it around. It yeah, out. so this tutu is like a troll themed. So. I, I think her name is Poppy, the main character. I haven't seen the movie yet, guys, so don't yell at me or anything. <laughs> but yeah, it's for her. And I did the swirly pink fabric, polka dot pink fabric, this blue and lime green, so. Came out really pretty, but let me go ahead and get on a her bottle made. There's the princess. Hi, sweet girl. She's playing with her toys. Are you having fun? Trying to keep her entertained while her bottle gets um, finished making. We are going to get a bottle warmer. So hopefully today we can actually get the bottle warmer. Because, uh, yeah. And I'm also putting three loads of laundry. This is laundry load number one. And I have two more loads. Plus whatever I'm washing as well. Which is the sheets and everything that I need to put away today. Oh my gosh. And then minus these. I'm just going to wear these today. But um, I finally cleaned off the top of this thing. These are his pajamas that he wore last night. Um, they're not dirty so he can wear them again tonight. Uh, but yeah. It's just lotions and Vicks and coconut oil and creams and stuff like that right there. Anais medication is over here. Uh, the thermometer's right there. Trash bags for our trash cans, for our little trash cans. Um, this is like a little comb, everything right there. Of course, wipes right there and the diapers right here. I'm also washing, oh, there's a, <laughs> the tutu. What's on there? Oh, did you throw, aren't you throw all those toys? Oh, little boy. He probably threw all these toys on here. I had them over here next to Anai. He knows that they go on her bed, so. Oh my goodness. Okay. I need to get more pink ribbon for this tutu. So that's why it's right here for now. So, but I'm going to have to get that today so I can finish that tutu. Oh, did you hit your head? Oh. <laughs> and then down here, I'm putting on Ace blankets over on this side. And then um, I guess her little toys and stuff I'm going to put on this side with... Uh, waters and stuff like that that I usually have over here so I just wanted to get it all clean and then I'm gonna figure out what to do with these two shelves down here because right now I just have books down there and right here is just packaging stuff and paper and stuff like that so I need to figure out what I'm gonna do with that just trying to get it organized because yeah so I'm just putting Archer's pajamas there for now but it looks so much nicer than did it did you find Luke? he's been uh -oh. missing Thomas and oh no monster. where's Thomas and he calls him Thomas he calls him monster but his name is James where are they? Where'd you find Luke? Where'd you find him? Where was he? Oh no. Where was he? <laughs> He's been looking for that train all day. Huh. He's gone. He's gone, okay. Well, we gotta find James and Thomas. Oh, are they on the floor? No. No? All your other toys are on the floor. We gotta pick them up. 
Because mommy's got a vacuum and stuff. Yeah? What's it got? I don't know. Oh, can you take the dogs outside? Can you take the dogs outside? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. They're coming apart. And welcome to another edition of Bob's Side of the Bed. Hey guys, and welcome to another edition of Bob's Side of the Bed. Um, today's topic um, is basically, since it's a new year, I think we all would benefit into starting to save money. Because that's really the big issue here nowadays especially with uh, 2017 coming around and we're starting up anew, I think it's always good to have a plan as far as your yearly savings. Now I know it's very difficult for some uh, due to some conditions and stuff like that, but I think that I'm actually going to provide you some photos and um, if we can, I will link it at the bottom um, to where I found these photos and, and how to save some money. Because in the end, money is what makes the world go round. Other than the jack-in-the-box scaring you in the face and making you poop your pants. So, um, these are just a couple of things that I saw that I may try this year and I may not. Because due to, obviously, the circumstances moving to our new hometown, um, it may be a little bit difficult for us. But, of course, we will go ahead and... Um, strive to be better for ourselves and for our kids right because that's really the important part is really just striving for our kids because obviously as parents we want to provide the best so that's why I give them my used underwear because it's the best it gave me the best 16 years of my life besides the extra holes but no I'm just kidding that is a total joke I gave Archer Cheryl's underwear and I just tie knots in them. That is a total joke. I am just kidding. He uses them as hats. That is another joke. I'm sorry. I'm just I'm just riffing. I'm just riffing here. I really am. But no, seriously. When the neighbor throws them out, don't be afraid to go through the trash can. You never know. You never know. One man's trash is another man's treasure. Or wardrobe. However you want to put it. No, I'm just kidding. That is a total joke. Obviously, these are all jokes. If this was actually real, I would be... CPS would be knocking at my door right now. And I'm not talking about the country people that stink. If you like country, I don't. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, no, I'm just kidding. I do like country. I like George Strait because I wouldn't like George Gay. That is another joke. If you're not catching these jokes, then maybe you should stop watching. <laughs> like, so... These are just a couple of photos that um, go in through the motions that I showed you. I'm going to show you again, probably not, um, that I added in there. I know one that I may try is the $5 box. Um, is where you, every time you uh, use a large bill, if you get any fives, you take all the fives that you receive and you put them in a box. I highly doubt I'm going to do that. Or there was another one that I saw, like if you fill, apparently... If you fill a two liter with dimes, it sums up to about 500 bucks. Isn't that crazy? $500 in just dimes. Hello, Coinstar. And even then, Coinstar is going to take about 3 to $5 from you. So, yeah, no. Imagine taking that to the bank. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and redeem all my coins and then just put it all on the desk. You're going to lose about $5. Either way. So, that's. Uh, my this is the second edition to Bob's Side of the Bed, all about saving money. So if you're able to try these out, let us know if you're going to start one of them, um, or don't. Make it a secret. 
from your kids. So that way you buy yourself Christmas seven, Christmas presents and not them. I am just totally joking. Buy them whatever you want. It doesn't matter. But, um, you know, some people use this to buy a house. Some people use this to buy a car. Um, and honestly, I if I do do one of these, I am going to buy Archer a car. And not like a real car. Because he's too little. Obviously. So, I mean, honestly, I'm probably going to buy him one of those um, those cars that they sell. Like Toys R Us. You know, the, the what are they called? The, the big wheels. You know, those, those big batteries, whatever. The big battery cars that they sell. I'm probably going to buy one of those. Um, I, I told myself that by the time he was three, he would have one, but obviously the circumstances, I wasn't able to get him one. But, um, once again, use the money wisely, um, use it on your kids, use it on yourself to put a down payment on a house, um, on a car, um, anything. Donate it to charity, that's also a good point. Like, you can always donate it to charity and just say, hey, I had a bunch of dimes laying around, throw them in a two liter bottle, hey, make a wish, here you go, boom. And giving is the best gift than receiving. I was going to make a joke there, but this is a family-friendly show. So I want to thank you guys again. Um, please comment below. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Share if you would like to share. Thumbs up. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been another edition of Bob's Side of the Bed. Thank you so much. You guys have a wonderful night. For guests, because we... <laughs> absolutely love um, having our babies in bed with us. It's not a burden to us. Although, yes, there are nights where Archer's literally on top of us or um, Archer rolls over on one side, Anais rolling over on the other side and I have like two inches of space to sleep. But I wouldn't trade it for anything. Bob and I both really enjoy having our babies in bed with us. So. We love co-sleepers. Right now, right now. One more time. Okay, can I